In a decentralized market, technology enables investors to deal directly with each other instead of operating from a centralized exchange. A decentralized market uses various digital devices to communicate and display bid ask prices in real time. This way, buyers, sellers, and dealers do not need to be located in the same place to transact securities or bonds. A common example of a decentralized market is the foreign exchange or Forex market. Here, there's no one physical location where investors go to buy and sell currencies. Real estate is another example. Buyers and sellers complete their transactions without first funneling the process through a clearinghouse. Certain types of bonds may be procured via decentralized markets. And the most recent example is the virtual markets and blockchain system, which use cryptocurrency. There are key advantages to decentralized markets. The absence of intermediaries can result in lower transaction costs. They allow for greater transparency between parties. And some believe they can greatly reduce hackers, as there's no single data resource to infiltrate though recently this has been proven untrue. A major disadvantage of decentralized markets, though, is there are no governing authorities to monitor transactions, offer assistance, or provide a legal framework. So while there are certainly challenges to be solved, decentralized markets offer exciting ways for investors to buy and sell directly, anywhere in the world.